Hi friends, I'm Cassie Kozrakov. Welcome to my course on statistical thinking. The course was recorded with a live audience and uh, maybe not the best mics, but I hope you'll enjoy being a part of it. Let's find out what statistics actually is. So are you ready to show some signs of life to learn some statistics? Yeah. Awesome. All right. So my first question for you is, how many fish are in this fishbowl? What do I hear? I hear four. I agree with that. Four fish in this fishbowl. And let's call them goldfish. Is it possible for goldfish to be of different colors from one another? Yes. yes. And is it possible for goldfish not to be gold colored? Yes. yes. Are these questions about data? Yes. yes. If you're having doubts, uh, feel free to put the information in a spreadsheet. Congratulations, you have data. <laughs> are these statistical questions? And the answer here is no. And here's why. Your first inclination might be to think that statistics is about going beyond the data that we have at the moment, and so the first question fails. I asked you how many fish are here, you told me four, there's no going beyond the data. But then the next two questions, they're not about only these fish in this fishbowl, they are about all goldfish in existence. So they go beyond the data. Yet the questions are not statistical because you can answer them with certainty. And when you can answer a question with certainty, all you need are the skills that you've used to deal with this fishbowl. You look at what's there and you say the answer. It's only when we're going beyond the data and we cannot know the answer for sure that you're going to need what we talk about today. So what is statistics? Statistics is the science of making decisions under uncertainty, when it is not possible to know the answer for sure. I like to think of statistics as the science of changing your mind. Bayesian statisticians change their minds about beliefs. Frequentist or classical statisticians change their minds about actions. You'll meet both of those in the course, but if you're curious to learn more, follow the links in the description below or on the slides. And if you like what you saw, please do share it with a friend. See you next time.